phenomenal women in our lives, be they grandmothers, mothers, sisters, and even teachers. For me, it's my mother. Today on Art Galore, we showcase and salute phenomenal women in our lives. Over the past century, women's role in shaping society has been more appreciated. And here on Art Galore, we pay homage to the movers and shakers in Kenyan society. In celebration of World Women's Day, Alliance Frances put on an art exhibition whose theme was centered on celebrating the diverse women in Kenya. One artist who showed their series was Claire Mungai, who used different strokes, colors and textures to highlight the intimate mother and child relationship as she salutes the most primal contribution a woman makes to society. I would definitely say Professor Wangari Mathai, she's an inspiration to all of us. Uh, I would also say Mother Karua, she's tough, she's phenomenal, as well as, well as Charity Gilu. Um, and above and beyond that, I think a lot of Kenyan women that are working in academia, that work towards policy changes for people on the ground, I think there's a lot of phenomenal women in our lives. Our mothers are probably the most according to all of us here, yeah. but um, there are other great and uh, very important women in our lives. We talked to Claire about the very intimate series and her thoughts on her maiden exhibition. All the paintings that you've seen today were actually to celebrate Mother's uh, Women's Day, which fell on Monday of last week. So I was doing our series to celebrate women and I was inclined to mothers just because I feel mothers are very important people in the society and I was trying to bring out the, the facts and celebrate mothers. I've seen some of your artwork and it's really beautiful. What's your process from you know, deciding what goes on the canvas to actually it ending? I use acrylic on canvas uh, and I paint using paintbrushes. I feel that I'm e I'm, I'm e uh, it's easier for me to use acrylic compared to oil paints just because they dry faster and they're easier to mix. So as a painter, what exactly is your inspiration? My inspiration comes from everyday lifestyle. Um, I look at a beautiful person and I say I want to paint that person or I look at, I get to see a nice landscape which to me looks pretty and I want to paint it or sometimes I look at the sky and I say wow it's a fabulous sky and I want to paint it. So really I would say my inspiration comes from what I see every day. This exhibition showcases over three different artists and their take on women. One such artist is Patrick Mukabi who celebrates the female form in a more vibrant and unconventional way. I usually do everything from sculpture, um, now I do also video art and sound art, but uh, I think for me I'm still, I'm still trying to push painting to the maximum, so when I grow up maybe I can decide to do something else. Mm -hmm. But uh, basically I've done all the formats. Yeah, everywhere I go, I see women, I go to the slums, I go to rural areas, I go to the city, and there's still women there. Even though everybody's got problems, nobody wears them on the face. So what I do, I try and capture the most positive area of this of aspect in life, the women's life, yeah. Um, using, I think I try and use bright colors sometimes to show the, the happy side of life. We cannot fully appreciate the beauty of Patrick's paintings until he explains to us the process involved in formulating each and every one of his arts. This painting was put outside the Kenya Bani exhibition. So when people are coming out, they wrote their feelings on this painting uh -huh. about the images you saw and everything. So I just claimed back some of the feelings by painting the women who are the ordinary person mm -hmm. who was affected from the events that happened. So it's like I'm claiming back the words into the women again.
as my time comes to an end, I decided to end on my favorite piece of the whole series. Not only because purple is my favorite color, but I think it's the most intimate description of a mother and child. I hope this feature has inspired you not to celebrate women just one day a year, but every single day for all the sacrifices that they have made. Join me, Samantha, next week for something completely different only on Art Galore. Oh,